Hello everybody, this is Brian Blackman here. Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Dark Rising Origins Worlds Collide. In the last episode, we went through the Drang Elec route. In today's episode, we're going to go through the Drang, Drang, Drang Elec, uh, I don't know where it was. Check it. So he used Walk Side to take down a Charizard, but yeah, Dragon Galley kills. Okay, we're going through the drink Dragon Galley kills in this in today's episode. All right, gonna battle this clown. He's probably gonna have a psychic type, but let's see. Or a ghost type. Okay. Hackmon. I'm gonna use Iron Tail on his Jinx. Hopefully, he doesn't miss. And it's missing. Here we go. I should easily take it out. Mm. Alright, that's Hackmon getting a level. And Klefki, I'm going for... I guess I'll go to Comfort. I'm gonna use an earthquake. Good thing you didn't use a reflect or a light screen to move like that. Because they have that prankster crap, which gives you priority to status moves. Okay, wise mine. I think that's a psychic type if, I, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going back to Tangan Guitar. Yeah. Hey, he has that ability called magic. <coughs> that magic bounce or whatever it's called. Where, that ability that makes you only take a damage from attacks or whatever it is. Yeah, it has that ability. Alright, let's go ahead and this uh, bud catcher. Drill. Wait, what, wait, what am I doing? Yep, we're good shape. We're good. All right, we're gonna use walk slide on this uh, B drill. Like Pinsir, yeah, I'm staying in. Let's go for walk slide. Uh, I don't know why I'm missing. I'm learning Stone Edge, but I love that walk slide. It would make double battles a lot easier. Alright, I'm gonna go for 
boost blocks, so you're just gonna make double bells a lot easier. He has a lot more power points. He doesn't miss as much. I, sorry guys, I really do prefer rock slide over Stone Edge. Alright, I'm gonna flip with the scissor. I have to use a full restore on blades again here. So I'm going to use a full restore. Let's put Hackmon in, Hack in front. That's Hackmon. Let's keep going. Wait, is there anything up here by any chance? Okay, nothing up here. Okay, let's go ahead and buy this, uh, this trainer. Okay, little Limon. Um. Hang on a second. Can you hit, please? Thank you. Oh yeah, Iron Tail is a little one. Okay, little one. Okay. Yep, definitely going for a bomb snail. Therapy, which is not going to do anything at all since it doesn't have a status helmet. Uh, my youngster have kind of should see updated it, but oh well. Holy crap! It's a double battle. Okay, it's a double battle. Um. Okay, I guess I'm going for. Uh, okay, Pidgeot and Tell him. One. <laughs> that town phone's gonna scare me because I'm four times a week to uh to fly type moves while Bob Snow is. Okay, I'm gonna go for Blizzard, and I'm gonna go for Rock Slide. Okay, we're good. We're good. 
Town Flames going for Sword Jam. We're good to go. Yeah, this is why. This is way here. Everyone is. This way here, ladies and gentlemen, is why I prefer Walk Slide. For battles like this, when you, you have to battle two flying items at the same time. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is why I prefer Walk Slide over Slopes over Stone Edge. Way here. And a bomb so just grill level. Yep. That battle right there is why I prefer walk slide over Stone Age. That's why I prefer, that's why I prefer walk slide. Stone Age doesn't hurt, hit both targets. Which I kinda wish it did. I will definitely be using it. I will definitely. If Stone Age would have used would have hit both targets, I would definitely use it over Rock Slide for sure. Because obviously it would be more powerful. But, but it doesn't do that, so Rock Slide does that. That's why I prefer Rock Slide over Stone Edge for that reason. Alright. Alright, I'm going to use Dragon Claw on this Dragonite. Here we go. Probably not going to take it out though because it has high defenses. Okay, I took it out. Good. Hack Mun does have the adaptability ability, which really helps me out. Uh, I have no clue what type this thing is. Uh, I have no idea. Bear with me. Hang on, bear with me. Wow, this defense is a crap. Wow. I want to see something. Okay, it's a dark type. Okay, uh, apparently, guys, I think it's a dark type. So I'm going to go for... Uh, for blaze again, I guess. Yeah. That's why you got bear yet. Yeah, we're gonna use blip break break on this thing. That's why you got bear with me, cause I I really don't remember what types these Digimon are. Alright, Milo tick. Alright, I'm gonna have to go for a bomb of snow. It's not gonna take it out because <coughs> excuse me. It's probably not gonna take it out because it's as my OTK has really high pretty high special defense. Yeah, I'm not worried about ice wind at all. A bomb, Mega Bomb of Snow is a very slow Pokemon as it is, so I'm not worried about it at all. We're gonna get the HP back anyways, so yeah. Yeah. It doesn't have very high special defense. It doesn't have very high special defense. Uh. I guess I'll finish off with Focus Glass. Oh crap, I was not I was not expecting that. Okay. I was not expecting that at all. Come on, can you not miss? Alright, Giga Drain. Screw it. Okay. Oh, okay, she's a new. Okay, I don't like when trainers do this. Why am I missing? Yeah, I'm gonna have to go for focus blast. I'm sorry. I have no idea why I'm missing. Come on, Bomba Snowkey, please not miss. Oh my god, come on. Hang on, guys. There we go. Jeez. I apologize for the delay, but it keeps missing.
that's one thing I don't that is one thing I don't like about focus blast it misses a lot and that's why I save state because I, I keep missing I don't want to try to use as many people in my team for one battle as possible that's why I save state um crap I guess we're going for a token kiss I guess oh Slash its Venusaur. This battle took, took longer than I wanted it to be. Today's episode is going to be longer than yesterday. For 16 minutes already. We should be almost to the end though. Where are we at? Okay, Drain Gallic Hills, alright. Drain Gallic Hills, or however, however you want to pronounce it. Alright, I'm gonna go for Time Minotaur because. This trainer we're about to have is probably gonna have Ghost or Ghost and Psychic Types. Alright, here we go. Tailmon, what? I don't remember what type that is. Hang on. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. It's probably just gonna be a I think Tailmon, Tailmon's a psychic type, if I'm not. I think it's a psychic type, because points were super effective against it. Yeah, I'm just gonna super speed through this. Yeah. And Hackmon just grew a level. Okay. Let's go and battle this trainer. Okay. Okay. All right. Lazy King and that's that con. Here we go. Break and Iron Tail. Let's go and battle this uh, hiker real quick. Let's you know, talk to him.
Alright. Okay, I'm go for go for waterfall. And Tanguinatar and Iron Tail and Aerodactyl. I'm not gonna take it out because. Wow, I'm surprised it took it out one hit. Okay. That's really, really good to know. Go ahead and grab this side over here real quick. And we get another choice card. Alright guys, I'm gonna end the episode right here. That's all for this episode of Let's Play Pokemon Dark Rising Origins Worlds Clyde. In the next episode we're gonna go through the Drank Gallic Hills. I mean the I mean the we're gonna go to the Drank Alec Cave. So there you go. This is Brian Blackner. I do have to thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.